What is it on guys? This is Ben here. Today, we are oh so close to reaching our goal. 10,000 trophies before global launch. Now, I have been up very, very close to 10,000 for a couple days here. I just wanted to take a little slow, but I tried grinding up earlier today and I was on such a bad losing streak. I literally dropped to like 9,920. So I had to gain all of those back. If you guys are curious how the brawlers are shaping up here. So we have Shelly that needs to get to 500. We, need, we have Colt that needs to get to 500. We have Jesse. We have Dynamite, which I really need to push up. He's a really strong brawler, but I just really need to sit down and play him. He's at 370. To. All the other ones are 500 except for Piper, and then I have Pam at 463. Everyone else, all good to go. Just need to be squared away with these ones. But these, the brawlers that I still have to push up, like hopefully when the next update comes out, we get a balance change, and hopefully that balance change buffs like Colt a little bit or some of those. I don't know. Just some. I feel like I feel like Colt's really weak right now. I would say Crow as well, and then maybe maybe a little bit of Bow. His star power is really good, but. He's not really great in other game modes. So hopefully we can get two two victories right off the start. Not going an incredible losing streak, but definitely subscribe and stay tuned because we probably should will be getting sneak peeks for the next Brawl Stars update coming soon. And if you guys are watching in the future, Global has already came out. This is how Brawl Stars looks before Global Launch. You notice the map is different. That's because for Global Launch, the 3D render. And I feel like I have to say that now for the fact that it's gonna look a lot different I, in my personal opinion it looks way better but i know if you're from the future let us know but for 10k trophy push it was a it was a very unrealistic goal like last month but just went hard on the trophy push so i'm so happy Mo majority of it came in gem grab um i used to not like heists at all or even uh brawl ball but i actually like those game modes a lot now so i'm glad the trophy push i kind of stayed away from showdown a lot Oh, we are with we can worry of the dynamite super. There we go. Got that one baited out. So we're doing pretty good here. They don't. Their team comp is getting really, really pressed. It seems like they have two mid brawlers because Jesse and and Penny are kind of like the mids that you kind of want to be. But I don't know. Nita's doing a really good job. We just need one gem. So I just need to not die. Uh, with nine gems, gotta be extremely careful. Defy could get that too because I don't want to extend myself and put myself in a very bad position. So. Just have to control the mid. I'm gonna go for it. There we go. They were pushed back, so pretty easy victory here. They didn't. They didn't. They only got one gem, but I think we took it. We took it over, right? Not bad. They're pushing us. I don't want to be trapped in that corner. Oh my gosh, man. Me dying here. Parzival is gonna clutch it up though. So that was my bad. I don't want to be trapped in the corner. Because the dynamite was coming down, and then I'm basically trapped in there. Because we've had a few games where whoever gets trapped in that corner when the enemy is pushing us down just dies, and then we have to reset it. So I was trying to like get to the other side corner, so kind of my bad here, but they're pushing us very hardcore here. Trying to dodge the penny a little bit. There we go. So match one underway. A little bit of a hiccup. Not a terribly good team. Thank God that didn't cost us, but I just had bad flashbacks of like two games ago when it was a really long game. <laughs> And we just kept like there's like so many gems on the map in this call because we were trying to get in that corner So we are one match away from the 10,000 trophies With Pam here and I think on this season reset because the season resets in like 12 hours here I have a couple brawlers that are like 550 or something like that or I know Brock is like in the 540 So I'll lose I think around 30 to 40 trophies on the season reset if you guys don't know any brawler over 500 trophies gets reset of whatever like that amount is so say you have a brock that's 550 you're gonna lose half of whatever he has over that so you're gonna get dropped down after the season reset to 525 so i yeah like, i think i'm gonna lose around 30 to 40 trophies so to be safe i gotta push up my other brawlers after the or basically before the season resets to retain my 10,000 trophies before then but not the end of the world if that doesn't happen I'll be able to push him back up anyways but for now my easiest brawler I think to be that I should push is dynamite <laughs> I just like I said literally need to sit down play some heist and get going heist is kind of one of like the I would say the the che like a lot of the cheesiest not cheesiest but like it's a, it's like a game mode where Anything can happen, really. Like, one wrong move, one wrong push with your team, and you just get obliterated there. So I have to be very careful when Tara does get a super, when, when she does get her super. So, try not to give her too much. Oh, huge leg spike there. I'm glad I did not die in that. Wow. 
that was an awful spike. Like, I was probably just standing still right there and they didn't even touch me. Oh, I'm so glad that didn't cost me my... Oh, God, there's a pull. She did pull me. But... We ended up surviving, retaining the gem. So I'm just still trying to reset here after that leg spike there. Oh, my God, man. That was crazy. All right, so... Getting pushed back here. The Dynamite making some strong plays. Trying to help Parzival with my, my super. There we go. Taro is probably very close to the super. But we regained a little bit of control here, so... Nice. As long as they're able to, like, push up. Taro is probably really close to her pull. She has her pull. Okay. So she's gonna be waiting for that one epic moment to, like, just drag me. Steal all the gems and declare herself the winner of this match. So... We're trying not to let that happen. Taro's over there, so we are on the cooldown. She does not have her pole anymore. Oh my gosh. Throw that down for us, wherever we may need it. I have the most health, so I can tangle with the dynamite for a little bit. There we go. Let's go. 10,000 trophies, man. Even with that crazy leg spike. I do not know how I did not die. My teammates must have protected me. Again, not the greatest team comp, which is very interesting, though. So, 10,000 trophies achieved. Huge shout out to Parzival, Justify, and anyone else that has been like my trophy pushing buddies. Like, basically, pretty much anyone on the friend list. I know Acid helped a lot, Haynes, Shadow, Bard was also 007. Just crazy. So, shout out to all you guys, man. And now we are gonna continue here. 10,000 trophies. Look at that. That league reward. Thank you so much. Now watch, we're gonna lose it on the next match there. But, oh, we got that new emblem too. <sighs> so I hope you guys did enjoy the push up though. Like it was a incredible grind, like literally like a month and a half, or I don't know the exact date. I'll probably look it up, maybe put it in the screen or if I, if I remember, but there was like a month and a half ago where I was at Luke's house, or maybe it was two months ago now, where I was at Luke's house, Brawl Stars right for everyone that does not know. Um, and I was at like 3,000 trophies. And I just like sat down with them again. I was like, you know, I'm really loving Brawl Stars. I'm gonna push and, and try. My original goal was 8,000 before Global Launch or 8,500 before Global Launch. Hit that, burn that out of the water. And then I was like, okay, we can keep going. We're doing, we're, we're progressing with the game good. And then I was like, you know what? Let's go for that 10K. And then Global Launch got announced. So then I was even hyped even more and push, push, push. And we got here. So really happy about this now too, because I just want to be at like a base 10k because I haven't been really pushing my brawlers that have been over 500 too much because I don't really want to, I didn't want to really drop them below and have to re-push them back up. But now if I can get like my base, be pretty much, this is going to be very annoying. Take out the Primo. There we go. So their team dump isn't great, but the Primo is going to be very aggressive and very hard for us to deal with. Like, it's literally going to take all of my being just to help out. Why didn't my super... Why isn't my super going down? I have, like, a very bad shot delay. Yeah, my shot delay is terrible. Like, I was like, why isn't my super going down? I was just chilling. Alright, so I am the lone survivor here, trying to dodge mortars, trying to dodge everything. The cult has given us a lot of trouble. It's not really the cult, it's mainly the primo, honestly, if we're being totally realistic here. So try and throw this down here. I dropped, I tried to make a play, try and pushed up, but didn't really work. So if you guys do not know what the shot delay is, though, it's like when you shoot and the bullets don't come out, they, they say once Global does go, um, go live, they might have a lot more servers in the game, so hopefully that doesn't happen, but yeah, it was that Primo that really just shot us down there, so dropped out. Let's see if we can get the 10k back here next match here. All right, so Parzival had to leave, picked up Haynes. See how this one goes. 
This is to get back into 10,000. I think this will be the last match of the video, though. I do have a little bit of a delay. That's gonna suck for now. The reason why the delay is big is because, like, it's harder to peak shot then. And just, it messes up your timing pretty much from what you're normal. That's why it's a big deal. But, we'll get used to it, I guess. Been playing it a bunch. Nice. Taking care. Kane's doing amazing. Their Pam is... Seemed like it got a little mad there and just went aggressive on us. I still need to get my... My super here. Alright, I'll give it to us. Let's see where they're at, man. Thought that super was coming out it did and it's st he still got all those shots off that's really interesting he died pick him up that was a really risky play hopefully i can survive dodge him it's random got him all right so we are back in the ten thousand. well barring a setback like the first match this time i'll go in the corner because i know their barley is dead and only one second left so there we go, back to the 10k, man. That's how we do. I, I thought they were a little bit better. They played definitely a lot better than what they seemed like there, but pushing up there, I guess we can maybe soon try and get Pan to 500. That would be cool. But back over to the 10,000 there, so happy. So we're gonna wrap it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. Hopefully you guys are hyped for Brawl Stars and can play it when it does go live. Next up though, like I said, hopefully balance change Colt gets a little bit of a buff. Shelly, I just need to play. Jesse, maybe if they tone down, um, if they tone down Penny, she might be a little bit better. And Dynamite, I need to sit down. But Pam, I can get up there easily. She's really solid. But and Mortis, need to push him up too. But thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. This is awesome Brawl Stars video. Hopefully you're hyped. I'm so hyped to finally hit 10,000. Let's go, man. I'll see you guys later.